want to stay here in St. Lucia. the sun rose in your eyes and the moon and the stars were the gifts you gave
Well, you're not Harry, ain't got nothing on you, your royalty. You think that I don't see you every day by the face that I see.
Rodney Alexander on bass. Sheena on percussion. Kevin O'Keefe on drums. We call them kicks. Well, you want to guess why? Terry on guitar. Michael Lauch, Tom and Keys, of course, by now. If you don't know that I'm born yet, well, what I say? If you call a woman African woman, don't go
again from Miss Barnett Bigfoot. Let's make her feel like she never left Trinidad and today we'll make some noise, give her a round of applause, and to her amazing band. Absolutely beautiful. I can assure you, you will be captivated by her performance and you will also have the opportunity to get a photograph and to get some merchandise after her performance. So bear that in mind. So prepare to be captivated by a voice that is redefining the landscape of jazz music. At just 24 years old, Samara Joy has already secured three Grammy Awards and a chart topping debut album with the prestigious Blue Records. Her rich, velvety voice, remarkably refined beyond her years, has garnered praise from icons such as Anita Baker and Regina King. Her incredible talent has also made waves on TikTok, amassing millions of likes and securing her the status as the first Gen Z jazz vocal star. The New York Times lauds the silky voice rising star for helping jazz take a youthful turn. Please. Help us welcome to the stage, Samara Joy.
feel so thankful to be here for the wonderful, the legendary St. Lucia Jazz and Arts Festival. How about a hand for the wonderful singers who set the stage on fire, literally. Oh my gosh. Thank you. <laughs> That's Evan Sherman on the drums while we're at it. Paul Sakibi on the bass. Cameron Campbell on the piano. That first song was a tune written by the great bassist uh, and composer Charles Mingus, and I decided to write lyrics to it. It is called Reincarnation of Lovebird. And now, if it's all right with you, we would like to go to Brazil for a second. And the angels let you leave and come my way. Don't you see what a lost lady I'm liable to be? The title is the advice, and it's called Worry Later. <laughs> wow. 
loud. If you wake up in the morning with a troubled mind, don't worry now, we're related friend. If you stop and read the writing on the wall, you'll find all your troubles gone later on. If your friends have gone and left you and you're in a hole, don't worry now, we're related pal. They will all come back and love you when the good times roll. Don't worry now, later on. Someday, you're going to a peaceful place with lots of time to run the race. So that's when you should catch up on your worries. Stop hurrying and remember to forget it when you're feeling blue. Don't worry now, we're related friend. Any doctor will confirm what I have said to you. So don't, don't worry now. Your friends are gonna let you get your in the home. Don't worry now, we're related now. I'll come back and love you when the good times roll. Don't worry now, later on. So then, you go into a peaceful place with lots of time to run the race. That's when you should get your money worrying. Take it slow, stop. Remember to forget it when you're feeling blue. Don't worry now, we're related friend. And you got to work with what I have said to you. Don't worry now, later on. Never imagined that I would be able to. I mean, I, I grew up around a musical family. My dad, my grandparents, everybody sings, um, and I, I just never imagined being able to do it like this, you know, for myself. Um, and it's been extremely exciting, but also overwhelming in a lot of ways. You know, being away from home, going from being home all the time to being away from home, and my mom is like, "Let's watch The Price Is Right. Let's come, come home. When are you coming home? You know?" Um, and <laughs> and she's like, "Send me the hotel you're gonna be at. Send me where you going. Write it on my calendar. Okay, I know exactly where you are at all times." Um, you know, and it's been a learning adjustment for me and for you know everybody around me. Um, and I've had to learn, you know, how to grow up. I feel like I don't. Sometimes I feel like I'm not ready for adulthood just yet. Like I'm like, can we slow down just a little bit? But you know, it, it's good. It's good to have these experiences and to and to learn for myself how to communicate, how to grow, how to sing better, how to you know play with these wonderful musicians and all that stuff. Every day, you know, is a new adventure. Every day is a lesson. Um, but it hasn't been without its challenges and without its growing pains. And usually, when I sing, um, that's when I can forget about uh, being an adult for an hour and fifteen minutes. <laughs> Sometimes you feel like giving up.
Thank you very much. Peace of mind and dreams come true. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. In times of plenty, you must be beautiful. In times of trouble, we must be strong. In times of joy, we have to be thankful. For life really has some ups and some downs. 